Tonight's weather forecast. Welcome back and a very good Sunday morning. Thanks so much for joining us after yesterday's wet weather that moved through today. We're slowly starting to dry things out across the region. Here's a look outside at Dallas. You can see things are pretty dry, at least on the pavement, but the clouds are sticking with us here this morning. Here's also a look out here at drums. Those temperatures right around the freezing mark at 33, but a beautiful sky so far. But still, the clouds are going to kind of stay with us as we progress throughout the day for today. In terms of rainfall yesterday, quite a, a impressive amount, especially we actually broke a record at Avoca Airport. We reached 1.25 inches, which actually broke our record back in 2010 of 1.23. So really not a huge record, but still lots of rain that moved through the region. We saw amounts anywhere from a half inch up to an inch of rain. Some spots even towards Susquehanna County saw an inch and a half before we uh, all said and done yesterday afternoon. So here's a look at radar right now. Things are pretty quiet, but we still have a few flurries or snow showers moving through parts of say of maybe I 380 this morning. We're still looking for most areas to stay pretty dry, especially as we take a little bit of a different view towards Muncie picture rocks, even up towards Williamsport, really not seeing much on radar right now, but we're still looking for a chance of a few flurries or even snow showers moving through the region for today, particularly for this morning as those winds are starting to shift out of the north and west as our area of low pressure is now up towards the north above the Great Lakes. So here's wind speeds right now, generally a good five to 10 miles per hour sustained. We'll still look to see some breezy conditions for today, anywhere around 15 miles per hour for some wind gusts, but the temperature's not doing too bad as you're waking up, heading out the door this morning. 35 in Wilkes-Barre, Scranton. I have 34 right now in Hazleton, and also I have 34 in Williamsport this morning. So not a bad start. Temperatures right around the freezing mark. Some areas in those higher elevations could see some black ice and un untreated surfaces. For temperatures this morning, we'll start off into the lower 30s. We'll be back up into the upper 30s, some spots into the lower 40s, which is still a good 5, 10 degrees above our average for this time of year. So here's future cast for you. The clouds stick with us for today. Really not much precipitation, but still not ruling out the chance of a flurry or snow shower as we progress throughout this afternoon to this evening. And then as we head throughout the day on Monday, we have a little weak disturbance kind of moving through, especially for the afternoon. So wouldn't be surprised if we see yet another round of flurries and snow showers for tomorrow and even continuing into Tuesday before our next area of high pressure settles on in for the day on Wednesday. So your eyewitness weather forecast for today, we're reaching right around 40 with a flurry or even a snow shower, but still pretty chilly and breezy. Highs into the upper 30s right around 40. For tonight, though, we're dropping back into the upper 20s with a mostly cloudy sky. Still looking for the chance of a passing snow shower while we'll the southwesterly wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Here's your seven day forecast for you. Still looking for a chance of a few flurries and snow showers for the day on Monday, even into Tuesday as well. Highs on Monday into the upper 30s, 36 for the high on Tuesday. We'll have a mix of clouds and sunshine for the day on Wednesday, right around 34. A little bit colder as we head throughout the end of next week, but at least we'll have some sunshine. We'll have a mostly sunny sky on Thursday, Friday and Saturday looking dry. Temperatures back into the upper 30s to near 40. You can always download the eyewitness weather app to your phone or tablet. Get interactive radar right into the palm of your hand and you can always find more by visiting pahomepage.com. So Julie, we've really been lucky over you know the past few weeks. It's been pretty mild, but for snow lovers, really not the best weather <laughs> that we've seen, especially for anyone wanting to ski. It's been pretty mild. Yeah, oh well, we can still get up on the slopes a <laughs> yeah. little bit. We still have plenty of winter to go. <laughs> of course. Yes. Thanks, Logan.